Hi, my name is Mitchell Wells, and for my demonstration speech, I will be showing you how to tie a Windsor knot. First things first, here is my audience, which is half awake, half asleep, and as you may or not be able to tell, only consists of three people. I had three people cancel on me really short notice, but I still have to make the video, so here we go. The first step to tying a Windsor knot is evening out your tie. This is going to be different depending on how tall you are. Myself, I am a taller man, so I have to allow myself more slack on the wide end of the tie. Next, you take the wide end of the tie and take it over top of the narrow end. Maintain pressure on the overcrossing point so that your knot has integrity. Secondly, you take the wide end of the tie and bring it all the way around until it is now in front of the knot. Next, you reach underneath the knot and pull up the wide end. It should be able to sit right on top of the knot, just like this. Finally, you take this wide end, and as you've been maintaining pressure on the knot, you have a nice crease for the wide end to slide through. As you're pulling it tight, you may or may not be able to adjust it, depending on how you like it. I like a, a wider knot. I just think it looks a little more presentable. And you're going to keep adjusting it until you have it where you want it. And then, obviously, fix your collar. And you are good to go. Um, a Windsor knot is the easiest kind of knot to tie in a tie. You can have a double Windsor if your tie is narrower. Um, I just believe that this is the easiest kind of tie. And hopefully by the end of this, you will be able to tie it yourself. And there, unfortunately, are a lot of young men that do not know how to tie a tie. So if you learn from this video, please reach out and teach a young man. It's, it's really sad the amount of young men that can't tie a tie. And also, I will upload two links, two sources that I'm citing for this speech that you will also be able to see a step-by-step -step, um, with pictures on, on how to tie a wind or not. Thank you for your time, and thank you for my audience for being here. I know it's not incredibly exciting. But I appreciate it.